What's up, guys? Chris Labash here. So, the 4S is finally all done. And do you ever have that moment where your car just sounds so sweet and perfect? You get super excited? Well, I'm kind of at that point. So, we did the front and rear diff today. It's the uh, new option from Arma. It is the 17 tooth pinion, the 49 tooth ring gear, in both front, back, running 60 in the back, running 60 in the front front pretty even um yeah you guys just you gotta hear uh my car it's uh it's sounding um a little a little too sweet So, yeah, I'm super happy with the results, and uh, yeah, I went outside and took her out for a blast. It was 20 degrees, but, um, you know, came back, everything was super cool. Um, I'm just at that point right now where I'm so amped to go to the park and launch this thing and just, you know, freak it again. But <laughs> it's the name of the game. Gotta pay to play. So, yeah, I'm running the LPs at least. Tomorrow, I'm gonna give the uh, I'm gonna give the 6S tires another shot. I don't think. Uh, oh, this is the outcap. She's about done. Uh, I just uh, geared her up. So yeah, went through the motor. Super smooth now. Center dish done, everything's done. We just got a, just got a little couple tweaks left there. I flipped, switched it to the uh, Fly Sky Radio GT5. Just more options than the uh, tactic, you know, and points. And, you know, I might, I might get a new servo here. I don't want to run it. Like I said, this was that budget build. So this one's just uh, full RPM. RPM arms, RPM bumper, RPM rears, stock chassis, stock servo, ESE motor, stock... Um, mounts and this beast is super fast and ready to kill I'm, I'm super psyched super psyched so uh till tomorrow guys and uh if you have any questions about the uh gearing it definitely took some some torque away, but I'm already on an 18 tooth pinion. I was gonna grab a 20 tooth the other day, but um, 
I wanted to try the uh, the new gearing in the uh, differentials. So also switch the uh, grease to uh, green grease. So everything's waterproof. Um, the shocks are working well now. We got a ton of droop in the front. We lost the droop in the back because of the aluminum shock shafts we put on, but um, not a big deal. But anyway, this is Chris Labash. Subscribe, like, comment. Get at me. Later.